Rivian has updated the R1T and R1S with a new infotainment system, safety software, and a big power boost for its four-motor flagship. Rivian's R1T pickup and R1S SUV have only been with us for a few years, but the EV brand has seen fit to give them some significant upgrades. You'll have to be a Rivian superfan to notice the visual changes, but there's a lot going on behind the surface. There's a new infotainment system, updated driver assist tech, a new three-motor powertrain option, and a big power boost for the four-motor version. The EV Upstart now sells two 1,000-plus horsepower vehicles. The four-motor powertrain increases from 835 horsepower to 1,025 horsepower. Torque output peaks at 1,198 pound-feet when using launch control, and Rivian claims a 2.5-second 0 to 60 run for the R1T. The tri-motor powertrain pairs two rear motors with a single front motor for 850 horsepower and 1,013 lbft of torque, which he thinks is more than enough. The dual-motor powertrain remains unchanged. Batteries have also been revised. Some structural changes in the large and max packages help save some weight, while a new cell chemistry is used in the standard package. The range of the MAX package increases from 650 km to 420 km on the R1T, but part of this is also due to the new heat pump design. The basic electrical architecture of the R1 models has also been revised to reduce wiring and the number of ECUs used. Rivian also tweaked the R1S suspension, which was criticized for being a bit too stiff and sporty. Recalibration was done for new springs, shock absorbers and hydraulic roll control system. New wheel designs are also available for both models, including the ultra-high-performance ear Michelins for the four motor cars, along with new tires to complement. Both the R1S and R1T get Rivian's new autonomy platform standard with upgraded driver assistance software and hardware, including 11 cameras and 5 radars. There's also an optional Rivian Autonomy Platform Plus that will add automatic lane changing functionality with a future software update. Despite all the new equipment, the R1T's base price remains unchanged at $69,900, while the R1S rises to $75,900. Crucially, this means entry level models fall under the $80,000 threshold for tax credits on new EV purchases but both the R1T and R1S only qualify for a $3,750 credit. New three-motor models start at $99,900 for the R1T and $105,900 for the R1S. That's several times more than current quads, but both have the larger max battery standard. The price of the quad engine has not been announced yet. Deliveries of the updated R1S will begin tomorrow while the date for the R1T has not been determined yet.